Butterflies have not always been the majestic and beautiful insects we see today. They were plain, some may even say boring, but not many people know how they became to be so wonderful. Once upon a time, chivalry and honor was the code which everyone followed. King Dakin of Ireland was the ruler of a great nation. He was loved because he treated people with dignity and respect unlike many other rulers in the world. He also has the special power of magic, and he was gifted with the power to speak to the animals and to the insects. King Dakin's kingdom was known for its beautiful countryside and delightful gardens. Some flowers grew over five feet tall. The colors were bright and vivid. Other nations were jealous of the fruits and vegetables that came from the king's gardens because they were the most beautiful in the whole world. One night, the gardens on the perimeter of the king's land were attacked by evil barbarians. The people of his kingdom were so devastated they turned to their king for help. King Dakin was worried. He had to protect the people and the majestic gardens. His kingdom was vast, and he knew his army could not protect the whole nation at one time. He didn't know what to do. One day he was walking in the palace garden. He saw a group of brown butterflies and separated from the other insects. That gave him a brilliant idea. He called to the butterflies and spoke in a soft voice. He asked the butterflies if they would watch over the gardens of his nation. Because the king was so loved, the butterflies wanted to help and agreed to watch over the gardens. The barbarians marched through the countryside looking for the most beautiful gardens in the world. The tiny butterflies whispered to the king and his army, King Dakin was able to force the barbarians out of his land because of the butterfly's help. They saved all the people in his great kingdom. Because King Dakin was so happy for their service, the butterflies were granted the gift of beauty. Their colors were bright. Now the butterflies had been blessed with the task of watching over the gardens and flowers throughout the whole world.